Christian Embassy, you have our back, you help us. Knowing that you support us enables us to help more people, and I really mean that from the bottom of my heart. To see Christians and Jews working together fills my heart, fills my soul with absolute joy and hope. And for me, this is a miracle. ICJA has literally saved and protected the lives of thousands of people and all the people who are connected with those lives. Every time my heart is broken, from Osher, there is no way to feel that in this age there is a support from the local people and from the people שלא שייכים פה, אבל ליבם, אני מרגישה ששייכים אלינו, ולכן אנחנו מודים לשגרירות הנוצרית. I'm very grateful to the ICEJ and to uh, all the Christians out there who love Israel, who pray for this Aliyah, and who help support this Aliyah. Thank you, ICEJ, for giving us this opportunity to come in this beautiful um, holy land and to be here and by divine appointment with God and to experience um, the time that we're having here now. Uh, just thank God for that. Those amazing testimonies that you just heard, imagine in 1980, 40 years ago, this was just 35 years after the closing of the gates of Auschwitz, Jewish-Christian relations here in Israel were virtually non-existent. And in that year, 1980, a group of pioneers, Christian pioneers, established the International Christian Embassy here in Jerusalem. And they started writing a new chapter of history with the Jewish people. It became an amazing picture, an amazing mosaic of what God is doing here in this land today. Forty years where God indeed opened historic doors for the Christian Embassy. Forty years of God's faithfulness to our ministry. And I know many of you have been part of what God was doing in those 40 years here in the land of Israel. Forty years, it's not just any anniversary, but the number 40 has great significance in the Bible. It speaks about 40 years of preparation of Moses, the deliverance of the Jewish people out of bondage in Egypt. It also speaks about 40 years of the Jewish people in the desert being prepared for the crossing over of the Jordan to take the land of Canaan. And also we are reminded that 40 years was the time where King David was ruling over Israel and he was followed by this incredible kingdom of peace under his son Solomon. So I do believe that 40 years of ICEJ, it's not just an anniversary, but that God wants to do something new. And I want to personally invite you to participate in the unfolding of this beautiful picture as it is being completed before our eyes. These are great days where God is writing history with the Jewish people, Christians around the world, and be a part of what God is doing right here in the land of Israel. <laughs>